Hi, I'm Jacob David. Today we'll be discussing a few considerations when installing equipment using an A2L refrigerant. Because of the properties of A2L refrigerants, installation and service best practices changed. It's more important than ever to refer to your install instructions before performing any installation or service as you adjust to the new refrigerant. First, a comparison of charge amount to square footage of the application per the install instructions is required for the safety of yourself and your customers. This ensures that the concentration will be four times less than the flammable limit. Next, it's vital to understand equipment within the duct system external of NGH equipment in order to operate safely when in a mitigation procedure. A few items to consider include zoning, external electronic air filtration, a separate furnace, or two transformer system. Another consideration for the installation of A2L equipment is the brazing connections. Be sure the system is brazed with nitrogen, free of leaks, pressure tested, and all connections are a minimum of 10 feet away from the gas furnace when installing or servicing equipment. A visual inspection of all braze connections must be made, including joints that may be inside walls. These are just a few considerations to make when installing a system. You should always refer to your installation instructions, local code, and ASHRAE 15.2 before your installation or service. For more tips, visit edgetechhbac.com. Making the world breathe easier is our commitment to you.